Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Jim here. For the third time in less than a week, Donald Trump has sounded the alarm about the huge caravan of Latin American immigrants traveling through Mexico unobstructed by local authorities and seeking asylum at the U.S. border. Now, previously, Trump used the caravan as an example of why his border wall needs to be built and also as an excuse to attack Democrats for their part in watering down border security measures included in the $1.3 trillion omnibus spending bill. He's also attacked the Mexican government for ignoring the situation, ominously threatening to remember their negligence as NAFTA negotiations continue. Today, he took his threats one step further, not only uh, threatening to kill NAFTA, which is Mexico's cash cow, but also to cut off foreign aid to Honduras and the countries that allow this to happen before closing with Congress must act now. And you can see that there in the uh, tweet. Folks, as the mostly Guatemalan and Honduran immigrants move closer to the U.S.-Mexico border, the Washington Examiner reported that a third Mexican town welcomed the caravan, which is about 400 miles into its journey and fast approaching the southern U.S. border. Now, folks, I had seen somewhere earlier this morning uh, while I was uh, looking for news that the evidently, again, I'm just uh, I am paraphrasing what I saw in some news article, the Mexican government is claiming it is going to break up this uh, this group of of migrants coming up through Mexico and headed toward the U.S. Uh, southern border. We'll wait to see. I'm, I'm very skeptical of that, folks. I'm a very, very skeptical that the Mexican government would do anything but other than allow, allow them to go through. Uh, we'll have to see what happens here when these people reach the border. Uh, what will Border Patrol do? Uh, who knows what else might happen down there? I mean, how, this, this could potentially become quite a scene uh, if this caravan is allowed to make its way all the way to the U.S. border, uh, will Donald Trump back up his threats uh, against Mexico and the Honduran government uh, and uh, using NAFTA as, uh, as a tool to do this? All things we need to wait and see, folks. I'll leave you a link to this. I'd ask you please to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Please give this video a thumbs up. Please share it if you feel so led to. And if you'd be so kind... Please check out the links to my fiction books below the video. Uh, they're available in Kindle and paperback on Amazon.com. You'd really like them. There's a link to a free read of a chapter. There's a link to some music of mine and to a PayPal page if you want to buy me a cup of coffee if you like the work that I do. I just knocked over a water bottle, folks. Most importantly of all, do not be given over to the spirit of fear, but instead of the power of love and of a sound mind that comes through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. God bless you.